Okay, here we are. We're going to clean out the carburetor on a Suzuki uh, Quad Sport uh, 80. Uh, okay. All right, there it is right there. Fairly easy to take out. Uh, I'll show you the tools you need right now, but uh, don't get intimidated. Don't be intimidated by it. It's fairly simple. And what uh, this thing's been sitting for a while, and uh, uh, it's running real rough. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm crank it up a little bit. That way you can take a look at it. But uh, all right, here it goes. need is a screwdriver and a 8 millimeter wrench and some uh, pliers. Right here. All right. I'm going to take the breather hose out that's just to get it out of your way since it's real simple to take off and on so okay and then uh, your throttle just take it out which is just fairly easy Because that one's, you're going to leave that bolt there. Okay. And then, uh, got to loosen this clamp here, which already started it. And then, take it off. Okay. Alright, so, as you can see, you know, it just comes right off. Alright, let's go to the other side. All right, we're on the other side. All right, there's your fuel. Make sure you put it on reserve. That way, if it, you know, it's going to drip a little bit, but drip out slow. And always take it off. Take it off the top here. Whoa. Okay. Wrong way. Uh, it's going to be that way. All right, here you go. Okay. You're gonna lose some fuel, but I mean, there's no way to shut it off. So, all right. So I'll take it off from there, and then let's go down. I went ahead and put a bucket underneath it. So it'll catch some of the fuel there. And you're gonna take a little hose here, and then the vacuum. Okay. Yeah, I went ahead and got a little wooden dowel. Just stuck it in there. So at least keep the majority of the gas out. Just give me a headache. Alright, so there. It's loose. 
So, do it basically. Pull it to you. the other side. screws here we gotta take off. that cleaned out. It's a little dirty. See how it's green? And uh, that cleaned out. Alright. All right. There's our injector right there. it wasn't too bad but as you can see it's just a little bitty old thing there so get that cleared off and you have another one which okay all right found a little screw I needed and uh, there you can that was the main this is the idle jet so Take this out. And then try to look through it. I don't know if you can see, but I mean, you look through the two holes, make sure they're clear. It's, yeah, they look pretty clear. And the same thing through that one. You probably, I won't be able to show it to you, but yeah, got a little debris in there. You can use a little needle or something, or and uh, just clear it out. Be real gentle with it. Don't put too much force on it. Make sure everything's cleared out. Little holes on the side. Blow it out. You see daylight through there. It's good now. Use a little carburetor cleaner in there and clean it up.
gonna put that idle jet back in. Like I said, it's, don't get intimidated. Everything's pretty simple. Just goes back the same way. Uh, make sure it's cleaned. You know, you don't have any trash in there, but I mean, everybody should be. I guess that's the biggest thing. Make sure you put, put it all back the way you found it. And, uh, We'll be good to go. Oh, we'll put it back together. And uh Said, I'm gonna put it back in and see what she does. Okay. clean it and now just adjust it to where you like the word idle. That's it. That's it for the little Suzuki Quad Sport 80.